What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of not launching and not starting properly issue you're currently having with Overwatch 2. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step is gonna be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click your taskbar and open up your task manager or simply use your shortcut for that. You're gonna navigate to the top left corner clicking onto processes and once you click processes, I want you to um, simply click one of those random processes. Doesn't really matter which one. And you're going to type in O in order to find Overwatch 2. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, simply right click and end the task. Once you're finished with that, I want you to end the task manager again. The next step is going to be to take your Battle.net or Blizzard or whatever and your, or your Overwatch 2 shortcut in desktop. And if you don't have it there, simply navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen. We're going to right, uh, left click onto your Windows symbol and use your Windows search function in order to find your shortcut. Once you found it, simply drag it right back onto your desktop. You're going to right click it and simply hit run, uh, not run as an administrator, click properties and hit compatibility and now copy my settings. So let's quickly run through it. Enable run this program in compatibility mode 4. Select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator. Hit apply and OK. I would personally recommend to restart your PC afterwards and once it is restored, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your shortcut and then you should be able to just double click it and start it and launch a game over the launcher or launch a game and this will probably fix your issue. Yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. And yeah guys, see you in the next video and bye.